Chances are you've heard of Google Search before. It's the world's most popular search engine. Want to learn about how it works and how to use it? You're in luck. I'm Jessica from techboomers.com. In this video, we'll be showing you how to use Google Search. Now let's get started. To do a basic Google search, go to google.com in your web browser. You'll see a very simple web page appear. Click in the text box under the Google logo and type in what you're looking to find. Once you begin typing, Google will make suggestions of what your search is going to be for based on things other people have searched for. Click on one of the suggestions or hit the Enter key on your keyboard to begin your search. Once you've done your search, you'll be given a list of results from pages on the internet. The ones that Google thinks are the most relevant to your search will appear closer to the top of the list. To sort your search results, click Tools near the top of your screen. You'll see three filter categories appear. You can sort results to see ones from your own country, filter by the time they were posted, or view results that contain only the word or phrase you searched for, excluding results that are deemed as being related to what you searched for. If you want to get rid of search filters you've applied, click Clear. Now you can look through your search results. Scroll down the page and check out what came of your search. Read the smaller text below a result to get an idea of what it's about. Click on the larger colored text to open a result. If you want to keep your search page open and not navigate away from it, right click on the colored text, then click Open Link in New Tab. If you don't really care to look through pages of search results and would rather simply be taken to the top result directly, type in what you're looking for, then click I'm feeling lucky. This will allow you to skip past looking at the search results and take you to the link for the top result of your search. If you're looking to find images with Google Search, go to images.google.com. The same as you would with a normal Google search, Click in the text box in the middle of the page and type in what you're looking for, then hit the Enter key on your keyboard. Google may also suggest more specific searches related to the keywords you entered near the top of the page. Click on one to see its results. Click Tools to view options to help you narrow down your image search. You can specify the kind of image you're looking for with filters like image size, color, file type, when it was posted online, and its usage rights. You can also search for images using an image that's already on your device, rather than typing in what you're looking for. This will allow you to find matches for an image online, or find similar images to one you already have. To do this, go to images.google.com. Then click on the camera icon to search by image. Click Upload an Image. Then click Choose File. Locate the image file on your computer, then click Open. You'll be taken to a page of results with matches or similarities to the image you uploaded. You can also search for videos on Google. Click in the search bar, then type in the kind of video you're looking for. Click Videos at the top of your screen. You'll be taken to a page of results with videos matching what you searched for. You may find video links or YouTube channels related to your search topic. Click on a link to open it, or right-click on the colored text and then select Open Link in New Tab. In the same place as you see the Videos tab at the top of your screen, you'll see a few more options. Click Maps to see location results for your search. Click Shopping to see search results with products you can purchase. Click More to find other types of search results, like news, books, and flights. If you don't want to type in what you're looking for and would rather use your voice, you're in luck. 
To search by voice, click the microphone icon on the Google homepage. You may see a window pop up asking permission to access your computer's microphone. If this happens, click Allow. Now, say out loud what you would like to search for. A page of search results will open, the same way as it would if you typed in what you want to search for. If Google didn't seem to understand what you said, you can always click in the text box at the top of your screen and type it in instead. That does it for this video on how to use Google Search. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, we'd love it if you'd hit the thumbs up button below. Check out techboomers.com for over 100 free courses on all of today's most popular websites and apps.